Well, it's not quite a quarter to three, but uh, there is no one in the place but Humph and me. Hundred Club has a lot of memories for you, Humph. Yes, yes, I was here man and boy for 11 years back from 1948 to 1959. And uh, a lot of the people we've been seeing in the last two days, of course, played down here. Rex Stewart, Jimmy Rushing sang here. Some peculiar memories too. I remember when uh, Keith Christie was in my band in the early 50s. He was playing a trombone solo. The bandstand used to be up that end. And the kitchens, because it was a restaurant in the daytime, used to be over beyond. And uh, in the middle of a trombone cellar, he suddenly went ashen white and, and stopped playing. And I didn't know what had happened. Apparently, he'd spotted a huge rat, which was apparently nesting in the left-hand loudspeaker, and had come out and run cr across the stage and back into the kitchens. Must have been a muskrat in the trombone <laughs> cellar. Yes. Let's go back to a session held on this very spot just a couple of weeks ago for our last item in this jazz weekend. It features a host of British talent, the Stan Tracy Quartet, the trombone group Fiver Slide, and first, the Pizza Express All-Stars with Wolverine Blues. The Stan Tracy Quartet. And now we come to the last couple of numbers in this jazz weekend, Jazz on a Summer's Day. I'd like to thank Humphrey Littleton for helping me to bring it to you, and indeed the BBC for putting it on. Five a slide are going to play us out. The first of their numbers is Let's Do It. Let's hope we can all do it again sometime. Good night. <laughs>